The Akhal Teke breed of horses is a national emblem of Turkmenistan, proudly promoted by the country's authoritarian regime. The head of its National Equine Association, Kerim Biashimov, has come to a show dedicated to the breed in the Czech Republic. It's a chance to ask about controversial allegations that Turkmenistan has allowed cross-breeding of the horses to make them faster for racing. But he doesn't seem to want to talk to RFERL, which is not permitted to operate in his country. <laughs> Sitting alongside Biashimov on a panel of judges at the show is one of his predecessors, Geldi Kiarezov. He was sacked and imprisoned by the Turkmen regime after raising the crossbreeding claims and now lives in exile here. Biashimov leaves shortly after our attempted interview. Then Kiarezov is confronted by the organizer. The moment was recorded on a phone by his daughter. Within minutes, the ranch begins to empty and the rest of the day's events are cancelled. We're told not to return the next day. Geldi has been told to leave. This is very rude. He's done a big presentation of the lines of Akultiki horses to teach people. It should be kept pure. Why? It's been pure for many thousands of years. Why mix thoroughbred with it? That's what's happening. Later, in his home, Kiarezov shows us parts of a presentation he wanted to make at the event. It includes a photo from 1988, when he rode more than 4,000 kilometres from Ashgabat to Moscow to promote the horse breed, which in Soviet times had been seen as potentially stoking nationalist sentiment. Kiarezov has called for Turkmenistan to use DNA testing in cooperation with international laboratories to determine whether horses are pure Akhalteke or not. But he insists he was not trying to provoke an incident at the event. Repeated attempts to speak to the Czech organiser were unsuccessful. The next day, a senior Turkmen diplomat is due to attend, and we're told we're not allowed in. The Akhal Teke is a beautiful horse, but it's also political. In Turkmenistan, there's even a state holiday in its honour. And as we discovered, questions about the breed's purity can sometimes provoke a swift kick.